How many of you ever struggled to get work done in while you were in middle school or elementary school or high school? And it affected you really badly as you were involved in either sports, clubs, or even had a job when you were like a junior or senior. And it, it really affected you and caused you not to get enough sleep and having to wake up feeling super tired the next morning at 6 a.m. for school. Um, imagine we had the opportunity to persuade the, um, the districts to, um, to push back the start of school to about nine o'clock so that our siblings wouldn't have to wake up so early and, and have to suffer as much as we do. Okay, um, K through 12 schools have later start times and would only benefit um, the schools as the production and students work would improve having more time to sleep and, re and having to let students rest their minds, giving them the energy to want to um, put more effort into school. And K through 12 schools had many of us going from early school start times after having such tough days of going to sports, clubs, or putting in extra time at school. And that forced many of us to be tired and end up going to school without any good sleep. I experienced having to go to school so early as it affected me mentally and not being able to focus as I was involved in sports or other activities that affected me. And in, I seen a difference as my school had um, pushed back the start of times on Fridays from 7.50 to nine o'clock. And it made a noticeable difference as not just on my grades, but also in my body energy. Uh, having mm, having K through 12 schools pushed back for a later start time would only benefit students in many ways as they will not have to deal with the lack of sleep and they would see an improvement in students' health and behavior and an increase in attendance rate for schools. Uh, first off, um, I'm going to explain to you one of the benefits of uh, having later start times for schools and that is kids will not have to deal with the issue of going to sleep, so uh, not getting enough sleep. Sleep is the most vital of human functioning and gives the students the opportunity to get more And pushing back the start of school will give them the opportunity to get more sleep and it will help them to have more energy and be able to produce more school. Sleep has shown that it can be and have its benefits and can increase many people's health as well. Research done by Matthew Kirby of, American, of the American uh, Psychological Association has shown that sleep can lead to an overall improvement in, in, in a human such as memory, learning, attention, mental health, weight control, and emotion regulation. It has also shown students who don't get enough sleep to begin with have a lot of problems in which they deal with mentally. There are many different areas in a body, uh, in a person's body that can truly, um, that cannot function if one doesn't get the proper sleep, and that they need that, um, that they need, and it affects them throughout that, um, throughout much of their day. Students who don't get enough sleep due to such early start times have reported problems such as information retention, bad student behavior, classroom conflict, attendance issues, mood regulations throughout the day, which is a ton of stuff for a student that should not have to go through at such a young age. Also, I'm going to explain to you guys um, another benefit of having later st school start times, and that is um, it can improve the overall improvement in the student's health in class. Having later start times helps students not having to dwell with uh, um, getting home and doing homework so, so late after a sport or club activity, and not worrying about the time and the need for sleep, and putting them under so much pressure and stress to have to do so much in such little time, as having more time to sleep will cool them down and relax them more. A 2014 study done by Kyla Wastorm at a total of eight different public high schools showed that schools will push back their start times back for a later time had improvement in many of the students' different moods and help of students. And she quoted as, students were now awake the first hour of class. The principal reported very few disciplinary incidents in the halls and lunchroom. And students reported less depression and feelings of greater efficiency. With later school start times and being able to wake up later and having 
and giving the student more opportunity to sleep. Students were able to get more than eight hours of sleep and were less likely to fall asleep in class and reported less symptoms of depression and did not do dangerous things without them. The later start times is what students need for them to improve their overall health. It is much needed that schools should do the same to see an overall improvement and, and progress for their students. To end off, one of the last things that K-12 schools having later time helps with is that it can show an, an increase in students' attendance rate. It has shown that students who are able to get enough sleep have more energy and want to go to class knowing they have, they have had enough sleep to get through the day and puts them in a position to succeed and not fail, which motivates them. Research done looking at schools' attendance of 30,000 students in 29 different high schools across seven states showed that two years after a delayed start in high schools, average attendance rates and graduation rates had increased several percentage points. If pushing back the start times not only helps attendance rates, but also helps graduation rates, it serves as a greater purpose to why and it's, it's needed for schools to see, uh, if they want to see their students succeed and graduate with a better learning experience. To conclude, the main points of my outline were to show you guys that pushing back to the start of school uh, should not have been just a thing for us, but the future as well as it can help students not have to deal with the lack of sleep, a increase in overall attendance and improvement in, in students' health. Kids at such a young age should not have to deal with the issues of getting up so early and many have to realize that kids should not be worrying about this issue and getting not getting enough sleep and it, in which if they have to deal with not getting enough sleep it puts them under the pressure and stress and stress can lead to depression and that is not and is that what you guys want for your siblings? I don't think so and you shouldn't either. Thank you.